Today, law enforcement came together to honor the life of fallen officer Kevin Valencia. He died yesterday, nearly three years after he was shot while responding to a hostage situation. A wreath laying ceremony took place at Orlando Police Headquarters today, and that is where we find News Six's Jerry Askin. He joins us now live. And Jerry, the police chief spoke about this just heartbreaking loss. You know, Ginger, what a heartbreaking loss. And the chief said that Kevin Valencia truly was a hero. He leaves a wife and two young kids behind. You see his department today honored him. They laid this reef outside of OPD this morning in part um, happening as we now know he'll be laid to rest next week after an almost three year battle trying to recover. He was and is a hero to us and uh, we will treat him as such. Orlando Police Chief Orlando Rolone joining his fellow officers Tuesday to honor a hero, Officer Kevin Valencia. And oh! His officers lined the streets for a moment of silence, all before reef laying ceremony outside the Orlando Police Department. When Kevin was first injured, he was given no hope, to be honest. Uh, then he went to rehab and it showed that he was a fighter. A fighter who died Monday after an almost three year battle trying to recover even at times showing major improvement. He was shot in his head back in June of 2018 as he responded to a hostage situation. The suspect eventually killed himself and four kids inside. Obviously the goal was that he would ultimately recuperate from his injuries, but the toll that it took in his body was just too much for him. His wife, Megan, has been by his side the whole time, even speaking to reporters about the devastation shortly after he was shot. Because my boys need a daddy. And, and I need my husband. Last October, his wife accepted several awards on his behalf, including a Purple Heart. Flags now at half staff here outside the Orlando Police Department showing respect to a hero who many say gave so much. Yeah, and right now, Valencia's wife and family, they're asking for privacy imaginably. So right now, Orlando Police Chief Rolone said he's so thankful for the support that his department has received over these past couple of days and past couple of years. He said Officer Kevin Valencia will be laid to rest next Wednesday at Orlando's First Baptist Church. We're live here at OPD headquarters. I'm Jerry Askin getting results. News 6. We're certainly all thinking about his family. Thank you, Jerry.